Good afternoon, it's Alistair from Motorhome Depot and this afternoon I'm lo looking at a Swift Contiki 679 uh, and it looks something like this. So in great condition on the outside, Fiat Ducato chassis, uh, chromed uh, wing guards there, in lovely in grey and white, huge Fiamma awning all runs all the way along the body there. We've got a gas cabinet here, it is set up with gas low system in there. We've got the water fill point here, coming along vent at the top there, awning light, got the Trum vent for the heating system and in here we have the shower external, sorry external barbecue point that one is, yeah. So at the back here then we have this huge garage uh, and this is a space to behold. Lots of room in here, lots of storage, got bikes in here, all sorts of bits and pieces. Got a spare wheel in here, a uh, proper spare wheel with a tyre on it so that's all ready to go tie down points so it's very usable for all sorts of bits of equipment and leisure stuff for fun accessible from the inside the body as well so you can get into it from inside coming around the back so there is at the moment a, a motorbike ramp on the back of it this isn't included it's just uh, still attached for the time being there is a reverse camera up there uh, and all the way around in very good condition so open up this side so you can have a look see. Again, great space this side. Right the way through. So going along, we've got the lavender box, we've got water fill for the flush, vents for the fridge and the freezer, and here we have the electric hookup, uh, 230 volt hookup point, and down here we have a look which has got bits and pieces in there. Beautiful condition all ways round. Let's have a look see inside. So going in we have uh, electric step over here, controllers for lights for when you step in, lights above you and uh, down at floor level, controllers for your Truma system, your heating system, hot water and heating, uh, all in easy reach there. And going in you can see we have this great big lovely light bright space looking very modern having recently been refurbished, re-upholstered, new seat covers, new cushion covers all the ways round. Had the, uh, the work surfaces all uh, wrapped so they're all looking uh, nice and new and modern and chic. So we've got the uh, sink here uh, and underneath here we have a hob uh, which has got three gas rings and electric. Down below we have the grill and then underneath that we have the oven. Paper roll, roll holder there, microwave, everything you need for a kitchen. Uh, plenty of storage space under there, a bit of a storage cupboard there, so plenty of space for everything you want to tuck away. And very generous transverse bed at the back here. Steps that the, the current owner's put in to help get up and down because the, the original ones are only very small ones, so he's put in uh, these ones here which are a bit bigger. Heading further back, we've got a tall wardrobe there, drawers and cupboards here, little makeup area and uh, mirror along with, which has got its own separate light. Big transverse bed, as I said. More storage cupboards over this side. Plenty of storage in this motorhome. Lots of, this is for one for going away and touring in. Little rail curtain, so you can slam the curtain when you've had words. 
Oh, and over here, I missed this earlier, huge fridge freezer. So freezer compartment at the top there. Set for three way, very easy to use. And nice and cool on a hot day like today, actually. I might leave, stick my head in there. Uh, and plenty of space for everything that you would want. Over on this side, you have a huge bathroom. This is massive. Uh, plenty of room for all facilities, sink, shower. It's got a shower screen that comes right the way around to enclose it. Simple to use like that. Just holds back in place. Here we have the front lounge area. This obviously converts into a bed. I'll show you in a second. But if you're not using it as a bed, what a great comfy sitting area. You can use this for guests, for visitors, for everybody. What a great space this is. Television. So you can see here that I've set up the, uh, what they describe as a double bed, but is very, very generous for a double bed. Um, you can see plenty of people in that, uh, but all, all set up from the, uh, the front lounge area. What a great space this is. Television, got captain seats at the front, so they both swivel round, so both, both spin so that uh, this gives you even more space. Space is really the answer here. Uh, up above, we have got the overcab bed. This is another big over, uh, overcab double bed. This very big, lot of space up there. And not only does it tuck away when you don't want it, so you've got some more headroom if you feel like it in the cab. Comes with this, uh, obviously with the original uh, DVD player, which is in there, so built in. Uh, and if you say, if you want to watch a DVD, you can do. Coming to the front, we've got, uh, so it's an automatic, Three, three litre diesel, chain driven, automatic, air conditioning, reverse camera, Fiat Ducato front end, classic front end, lovely condition always round. So here we have a beautiful Swift Contiki 679. This is a touring car, uh, touring motorhome really. Uh, you've got twin rear wheels. Uh, it is 5,000 kg, so five ton. Uh, it, you'll need a C1 license for it to drive it, but inside, beautiful. Refurbished, reconditioned, reupholstered, however you want to describe it, looking great. Everything in uh, tip top condition. Fully equipped, fully loaded, ready to go. It's got gas low, it's got automatic, reverse camera, everything, everything you would want on it. Uh, if you'd like to see any more information about this, if you'd like to come down and visit it, like to come and uh, have, a, have a look around, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Give me a ring, give me a text, give me a WhatsApp, any way you like it, just get in touch. And please don't forget to like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thanks very much.